all photographers are seeking this place where their photographs achieve a certain power of memory, a certain kind of consistency. Because face it, the world doesn't line up for photographers. We have to oftentimes go in and just wrestle something to the ground. And one of the ways we do it is with good command of our tools and I think principally light. Control of light is something that takes a while to establish. You know, lighting this but not that. Lighting her differently from him. All of that stuff bundles into this toolbox that you need to make sure that your good pictures are not like lightning striking. We're going to talk about f-stops, shutter speeds, size of sources, placement of sources, the big three of light, quality, color, direction. Beyond that, location assessment, how to edit yourself before you even spike the camera. What is possible? What's the mission in the photograph? All that stuff has to factor in your head. It's like a computer running several programs at once. The worst critique I ever got from any editor was like, oh, these are nice. Do you want your pictures to be nice? No, you want your pictures to be declarative. You want your pictures to just inform. You want it to educate. You want people to look at your picture and understand. Your imagination is this amazing thing and it takes confidence to express that imagination and get somebody on board with it. Somebody could look at you, if you're kind of wishy-washy at the camera, it's like, I don't think so. But if you convince them that A, you're passionate, B, you're not gonna waste their time, and C, I've got the skills to really pull this off and it's worth it that you and I take this journey, that's a really good place to be.